day I found out I had cancer, so I was riding my bike up Long Bo Key here in Sarasota, and it started to feel a little funny on the way back. The next thing I remember was waking up in the hospital. I felt like my biggest fear was coming true, which was there was only Tony and I growing up, and so I had this fear that, that, that something would happen to him. He was diagnosed 10 years ago. I was dealing with disease as well um, for 10 years. So we've really had these parallel, um, this parallel journey together through cancer. He just had a challenge in front of him and he just went through it and it wasn't a negative thing and it was a positive thing and I think that's an amazing thing to see. I'm not sure how I felt when I first was diagnosed. You know, obviously in shock like everybody else. Yet I just kind of, at that point, I just said, you know what, I've got to put my head down and deal with it. He was going through radiation, I think on a daily basis, and so we would ride our bikes to radiation and ride, ride our bikes to work. It was a huge goal of mine just to be able to walk with him while we're coming back from Duke. So I, I did that. It was neat seeing people wondering what you were doing. I loved watching people's reaction to his answer. So he would say, this is what he's doing, and they'd be like, are you crazy? Or are you, you know, do, do you know what I mean? Like they just didn't, didn't really know, and so that was really, that was really fun watching that. And Watching people really, the people who got it, got really inspired. My goal for Team Tony is to be the prominent one-on-one -on -one cancer support system on the Gulf Coast. I just feel that you know, there's so many people locally diagnosed with cancer that I'd truly like to make a difference in our area of people who have been diagnosed and provide one-on-one -on -one support to as many as we can. Tony's idea to start Team Tony Foundation was born from not having that someone to talk to when you're diagnosed with cancer. He felt that um, through his struggles with cancer and getting diagnosed, he always had a core group of people always helping him. So it was a team basis and because he was an adventure racer, everything was based on a team. I just wanted to be a part and feel like helping other people go through what I went through. You can live, and there's some people who have gone through the same thing you're going through now, and they're surviving and living their life, and you can too.